So, and just to emphasize, one of the one of the treatments for ADHD or for addictions is, of course, motivational enhancement, motivational interviewing. People under, know what that is. I have like a little slide just to review it, but. Um, so one of the books on motivational interviewing describes it as any operation that increases the probability of entering into an active stage of change. And um, I suggest that ADHD coaching or ADHD treatment falls into that category. One of the reasons are, as I said, people don't think their drug abuse, drug use is a problem because what abuse means is that it's creating problems in their life. But their storyline may be, well, of course I have to drink and smoke pot. I have so many problems in my life. How do I cope with that? And um, what happens when a person engages in any kind of coaching is that they can switch that around to, my problems are so big because I use alcohol or drugs. And so the way that that happens is coaching involves goal setting. And so once you have a goal, you kind of reverse engineer so why haven't I met that goal? And a lot of times it can be really simple. Oh, well, yeah, I was hung over here, or you know, I can't work on these projects at night because I've already started drinking by six o'clock. Um, so people reverse engineer, and then they see the connection between drug or alcohol use, and they're not achieving the goals they want for themselves. 